Benny Arquides, fifth degree black belt in Kempo, undefeated as PKA, WKA, and NKL lightweight and super lightweight champion of the world. Down for rolls. Down. And in. Get used to slapping the mat in the dojo. It aids in breaking your fall, and your hands will be in a position to respond instantly. Two. Send the mat. Two. Two. While practicing in the home, use training mats or a soft surface on which to work out. Keep your head off the mat at all times during the workout in the training room, the dojo. Move. Simply sit to the back of your heel, rolling as you fall back. When the small of your back touches the mat, simultaneously slap the mat, feet to the air. Side slams, down. With side falls, from a crouched or standing position, swing your leg to the opposite direction to which you are falling. Roll to the side, Always slapping the mat as you touch. Move. Shock for shock. Standing position. To the left. Move. Two. Three. And one. Move. Okay, down. We die, Miji. Ready? Body slam. Down and do it. Don't be afraid to fall forward. In the dojo, look to either side to prevent injury to your nose or to avoid a stone or a rock in the street. Everyone body slams. Ready? Move. Slap the mat oh. and ki as you hit. Nice ki Ready? Oh. The shock is evenly distributed while releasing oh. energy with a ki oh. The rolling falls are traditional, simple, true, and quite safe. Tuck and roll to an alert, ready posture. Legs are bent 90 degrees to one another. Slap the mat as you hit. Form repetition, both left and right sides, from the kneeling position or standing. By learning how to fall, one can reduce the chance of serious injury in a self-defense situation. disciplined, graceful dynamics of the Aikido fall. With the mat as your ally, your left or right arm leads the rolling tuck. You act as a wheel. Roll to your feet in a balanced posture, or return to your feet facing the direction from which you started, poised. As a beginner, you shouldn't attempt the more difficult basic falls at first, such as the back fall from a handstand. 
Overcoming any fear of falling you have requires patience, discipline, and form repetition. Self-confidence will evolve. doesn't have to be big in order to defeat a taller man or a stronger man, as long as he has the knowledge and the leverage to outmaneuver him. The ABCs of striking is learning the vulnerable areas of the body to strike in alphabetical order. Striking an opponent in a self-defense situation means entering the correct striking position and understanding what weapons of your own body you are to use. In a street defense situation, your mind must be trained not to think, but to react instantly, correctly, and with control. Everything has a little recipe to it. And I believe if you do anything, you do it mentally, spiritually, physically, and you do it with your heart. And no matter what it is, if you can go with that kind, the cake will always come out right. Mm -hmm. 